Welcome back to the Hunter Call of the Wild. I'm here back in Australia and I have just spotted that one species that I have not seen so far. And that is the Javan Rosadir. I honestly even forgot that this map has the Rosadir in it. But there we go. It's my first one that I see and it's a level 4. And the best part? Right there. <laughs> I have another level 4 Rosadir. Can you believe that that's like 100 meters away? This guy is just solo by himself. But this guy has a whole herd right next to him. What I'm gonna do is to get behind these guys over here. Call them in. See if I can get, take them down with the bow without this guy realizing that I am there. And then get to him. Call him in and take him also down with the bow. Because these guys have enough distance between them that I can go 200 meters or like 150 meters away from this guy on that side. Call him in and the other guy should not be coming in. Their rest time is fairly long. This one is from 1 till 5. So I have a lot of time here to burn. So I'm gonna start sneaking in and see how this goes. At times like this I hope they would give us two markers at least that like minimum so i could keep track on both of these guys another thing that i can do is that these guys are 180 meters or so out i could also put a stand right here this guy is 192 it's 167 or so let me double check this yes he's 170 meters out and the other guy it's always better to check from the map if you're not sure, 196. So what I can do is I can back up from this. So this guy is 200 meters or so out. Put a stand and then call them in. The other guy should come first. And stuck behind these trees and put this here. This guy should still be way within the limit of me calling them in. Yes, 180 meters. And the big guy over there should not be. He's he's on the edge. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. He's giving a couple of good calls. Are we gonna have these guys coming in? She has stood up. He's coming in. Thank you, this guy is also coming in. He was way too close. But I also found out that this caller, this mouth caller, range is 500 meters. That's just not correct at all, I'm sure. The turkey caller has 500 meter range, range. But will they give 500 meter range also to these Rusa calls? I honestly can't tell at all. That would be insane if it has. I need to test that out. Look at that color variation though. All of these three ladies are different color. Wait, that's a lot different one. It's level three. Oh shoot. This is gonna run off real soon. There it goes. Now did he spook the rest? Where is the level four? These guys are running off. I don't actually mind that, as long as it doesn't affect the level 4 coming in. He's calm, but this happens when the whole herd spooks. Also, the animals that are not even close by, but are part of the herd, stop responding to callers. Like, if you spook females like I just did, the males at the back are not gonna respond to the callers anymore. There he goes. He's conflicted. <laughs> but... I should still have the other level 4 coming in. Wait, what? He went back to rest. Okay, this needs some investigation because... Can I get him to come here? Completely calm. Just doesn't care. And this guy has run away. Yeah. Well, that changes plans. 
So that means one of those females that actually ran away were part of his herd. Okay, this guy is now fleeing, which is fun. Now, if I was hunting with rifle, this hunt would already be over. <laughs> I mean, I could just blast them from the distance. I can probably go prone and can approach him very close. This guy is the bigger one, so I need to take him down. But if I can take two level four potential gold, that's gonna be awesome. If I can hide in this bush, I'm gonna be golden. You freaking kidding me? It's the same bush that I just hid in. I cannot hide. <laughs> There are no hiding spots available at all. What I can do, this is gonna be quite risky. I can stand up. Hopefully he gets up and I have like second to take the shot. Couldn't spot him. Couldn't spot him at all. I had the prompt just for a second, but I did not catch it at all. He should not be too far. There he is. Get up. He's attentive. Is he blind? All I want you is to get up. He went back to calm. Are you kidding me? Okay, I can take the shot straight through him. This will be good. <laughs> Did you see that jump? <laughs> he almost made a flip. Holy crap, okay, that was awesome. Let's have a bit closer look. <laughs> Still can't believe that was the shot that I had to take. <laughs> look at that. I like that they have like really detailed eyes. Look at that. The eyes are great. All right. Let's pick this guy up. And there we go. He's a light brown level four gold. 112 148.78 so his max score was diamond <laughs> but he is quite far away from it but still how was the shot it's a perfect double lung shot look at that flesh left lung right lung 31 meters happy that i used the second pin and there is so much detail on the new animals, especially the animals on this map. For some reason, they look so much better than the previous ones. Holy crap. They have really put in the work. And you can clearly tell that these animals have been on the oven for a bit longer. Because in the previous map, they had no new animals at all. So this map and these animals have been under work for quite a bit longer than they usually have. But that's awesome. That's my first... Yavan Rosadir <laughs> and he's a level 4 gold with the bow I'm actually gonna taxidermize him because who knows am I even gonna get bigger gold ever so <laughs> I'm not a trophy hunter I hunt what I see so if that's the biggest one I have that's the biggest one I'm gonna taxidermize but now let me quickly see if I can catch the outer herd maybe have second level 4 so I'm gonna change the time slightly back to 1338. I couldn't find the herd anywhere, so they had really took off. The wind is blowing straight where they are. Holy crap. They are coming from that side. So at least I have confirmation that the guy is in the area. I got around the wind. It doesn't seem to be an issue anymore. I hope so. There's the first one. That's a level 3. Now I just need to find the level 4. I can't see any other deer. Like this guy is just by itself. 
this is way more tough than I initially thought. <laughs> I just thought I'm just gonna go there and shoot the dude. But he's giving me a challenge. He's not letting me go that easily. So that means that... Oh, there they are. There they are. I got you now. <laughs> Why are they so far away from this guy? Is the level 3 like exile? Oh, there it is. There he is. I got you now. The wind is perfect. So it was worth the whole time. Just circling around. 192 meters. I should be able to get to these bushes. 92 meters out. He's attentive. How? How the heck? It has to be... 92 meters, I'm completely crowd. I'm crouched, crouching the whole way behind the hill. At 90 meters, he went alert, but so did the level 3 on my left side. There has to be some connection that this guy is so much closer than the level 4. Okay, he went back to calm very fast. So, <laughs> crisis alert averted. 45 meters. Attentive. He knows something's up. <laughs> just go back. Just, just calm down. There's no threats here at all. Yeah, see? There's a tree. Holy crap, there's a tree between me and him. Yeah. I almost took the shot, but glad I saw the tree. <laughs> Dang it. To be fair, he's in way better position now to be shot. <laughs> this female is having fun with the rock. <laughs> He's gonna go to attentive real fast. I'm gonna get to 45. Okay, he's attentive. Thought so. Come on. Once he goes back to calm. Because last time he got up so fast. He went from calm to alert in a matter of second. So 45 meters is not too bad. Because they went alert once it seems like they are taking their sweet time what that bunch of nonsense come on do it what the heck What was that? You're testing my, <laughs> my patience here, dude. <laughs> I'm patient, man, but I have my limit. How did that make any sense? He went from calm to alert lightning fast. Like right away. That, that felt like robbery. <laughs> Now, where the heck is he? Okay, see if I can catch his attention. Come on, you did it before, you can do it again. That lady got up. Come on. Now you take your sweet time. Are you kidding me? Come on. I'm right here. Attentive. Come on. You can do it. Are you serious? <laughs> I'm lying down, prone, eating dirt. You can go to alert in right away. I'm crouched 
closer than I was before. And you're like, yeah, I think that's fine. <laughs> okay. What the freak? I should never trust the trees. Never. <laughs> yeah, okay. That's so close. The shot was 100% clear, but oh man. That was a tight shot. I really had no choice. Ah, okay. Well, the lesson we learned today is that sometimes the elements just don't go your way. <laughs> At all. This guy was a tough one. I am gonna conquer him. But, man, I feel defeated. <laughs> that was brutal. This guy really gave me a challenge. But sometimes you need that. Sometimes you really need a good challenge in a game. It is what it is. I chose to play. <laughs> I chose to take him down the hard way with the bow. And sometimes these things happen and you learn. This is how you learn from it. <laughs> but okay. I think I am pretty much done for today. That's gonna take me a bit of time to, came, to come back to him. I'm gonna explore some other part of the map in the meantime. Hopefully find some other rare, nice rares and trophy animals, who knows. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you for watching and as always, have fun, happy hunting and I'll see you on the next one. Bye bye.